And welcome back. All right. He, they, Aria wants us to protect this patriarch fella. And doesn't want it directly connect to her. I'll look into it. Good. Patriarch's downstairs, likely surrounded by his fans. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. Come back here when it's done, and you'll get your due. I'll be back when the job's done. Good luck. All right, side rooms. I think that's the one that the uh, recruiters are at. Would have been awesome if instead of uh, merc recruiters, there were like religious recruiters looking? there. It's just you. Uh, I think I feel my morals loosening. Yow. That's a. Give me another drink, love. I think I feel my morals loosening. And he, yeah, there's someone that could have been there if we don't. Last a human colony called Freedom's Progress has been attacked by unknown sources, marking yet another in the chronicle of the humans' failure to defend their own colonies. Well, not sure if this is where we're going to look for him. Dancer. Oh yeah, this is probably the one. There he is. Don't act like you know. Just plan for the funeral normally. During the service, someone will want to set up a meeting. He's in on it with whoever killed your family. You tear off a few of his fingers, you'll find out who did this to you. Sage advice. If I know what you were right to come was. to me, I can talk to Arya for you myself. A skeptic. Ha! I'll get them to lower the payments. We can't keep taking your money if your business goes under. And you will owe me a favor. No. You said he had close family. They'll just want revenge. Kill the family first. Then he'll get angry and come at you stupid. And then you kill him. Unless he's the Punisher. I don't think I know you, human. I'm the Patriarch. Arius Patriarch. What do you want? Why do they call you Patriarch? It's like an Asari Matriarch, only male. It was Arya's little joke. After she took me down, she let me live. Kept me around as an advisor and a trophy. Hmm. Rumor has it some people want you dead. Know anything about that? Oh, well, I can think of a few. I know things. Old secrets, old grudges. A few floors you can dig up to find bodies underneath. Someone who wanted to weaken Arya might come after me. They do it to get to her, you see. Not for me. I don't matter enough anymore to have enemies of my own. I'm not important. No one wants to kill me. A Krogan as old as you must have some great stories. I killed a lot of people, lived well, and was beaten by a small Asari who keeps me around as an example. My time is done. Anyone I killed is long forgotten. The stories are Arya's now. Very, um, odd view for a Krogan. What do you know about Arya? Uh, a few centuries ago, Omega was my rock. When Arya arrived, she had nothing but the clothes on her back. I thought she was another dancer. <laughs> She killed half my men and convinced the rest that she could run this place better than I did. She came for me here in this bar. We tore this place apart. She crushed one of my hearts, shattered half the bones of my body, and left me alive. What made her decide to leave you alive? 
No, she doesn't destroy what she can use. She said I could have all my old comforts if I served as her advisor. I knew how things worked. I knew who to lean on, who to smack down, who to smile at. Right, right. And everyone who respected me saw me beaten, broken. They knew that as strong as I'd been, she was stronger. Yeah, okay, I can see the logic here. Some people want you dead. I've been asked to move you to safety. Well, of course. Arya wouldn't want me hurt. It would make her look bad. Or perhaps Arya's reputation is no longer my concern. Perhaps I will stay. And see who thinks me important enough to kill. Yep. Well, you can try to convince them, or you know, you could say, "Hey, you know what? We'll be your crown. We'll be your loyal." fighters and beat them down or we can do this you allow Arya to protect you like you're her pet I thought you were a Krogan Arya let me live she gave me a position of honor as her advisor she gave you a position of comfort as her trophy is that what you want or would you rather go down fighting I wish she killed me the day she beat me that would have been a glorious death Klingon. But perhaps it is not too late to die well. Perhaps these assassins will remember my name. Yeah. Farewell, human. And thank you. Okay. Now, Now, before we go back and talk to Arya, there is something I want to do. Yeah, let's grab a drink while we're here at a bar, right? Now, either you can't hold your liquor, or something just went wrong. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Paris. I should have warned you, Shepard. I'm sorry. Um, thanks, Garrus. Mm. How much did I drink? One drink. That's all it takes, that racist Batarian bastard. Looks like you broke the first rule of Omega. Don't order a drink at Afterlife if you're human. Humans aren't welcome at Afterlife? It's just that one Batarian bartender. He's got a stick up his ass about a bunch of Batarians that died a while back. No one does a thing about it, though. Humans ain't exactly held in high regard around here. Wow, you gotta love belonging to a species that is apparently so down, or so high on the hated list, that someone can regularly kill members of your species as a met part of his job and not get fired. Or even get a write-up. That bartender tried to poison me? Tried is the word. As far as I know, you're the first human to survive it. Me and my friend Jake went there to celebrate our new shipping business. He got real drunk. And an hour later, he was puking blood. I think I'll go give that bartender a taste of his own medicine. He won't be expecting you. That's for sure. Give that Batarian bastard what he deserves. <laughs> See, apparently... Commander Shepard is just made of awesome and win. Walking around in this place makes me sick. People still dying, the strong still exploiting the weak. Nothing I did here even made a dent in this. I mean, it's like you think a little bit of poison is going to kill? Nah. Vorcha adaptation interesting, not just biological, social as well. Urban area adapting to them in return. Large concentration. 
Hope they're controlled. If they attack, as happened near my clinic, casualties likely. Hmm. All right. Let's find this guy. Do I know you? No, no, you humans all look the same. Here, have a drink on the house. But, but, you drank? You should be dead. Wait, you don't want me to. I'm a ghost. Now, drink it. I, no, you can't. I, drink it, or I'll blind you one eye at a time. Now, I find it interesting. He kind of went down, but this weird green stuff spurting out the back of his head. What exactly was that? And the stuff I came down here to make it to do, picking up that brandy. Not much. Does all that chewed up many Ari's time. So beautiful. Oh yes. A wrong wow. direction. The whole club is spinning. Alright, Chris, I did the job. Arya wants to speak with you, human. Something about Patriarch taking on a squad of mercs by himself. I wouldn't keep her waiting. Uh yeah. She wasn't quite the uh, asking for that result, was she? I heard my old friend Patriarch died. Went out in a blaze of glory. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Heck yeah. I gave him what you couldn't. The chance to die like a Krogan. That wasn't your decision to make. His life belonged to me. Patriarch was dead for centuries. You know that. How he was? I'd almost forgotten he was a Krogan. You gave him the death he deserved. That's odd. She almost seemed to like him. In a weird way. You've done a lot for me, Shepard. Let me return the favor. We're sending your coordinates to a cache on an uncharted world. You want it? It's yours. What's the catch? No catch. I don't need it and I don't want it to go to waste. Whatever you find is yours to deal with. Sounds like you and Patriarch have a history. Our history is Omega's history. Long, bloody, and always ending in my favor. The details are complicated. When I arrived, Omega was lawless, a land of opportunity. I built alliances and destroyed the fools who wouldn't get in line, which was most of them. But Patriarch, he was something different. A powerful friend. I assume you decided he was too strong, even as an ally. No, he cast the first stone. Wasn't a surprise when he turned. He controlled the muscle. My people contributed more subtle action. Espionage, politics, assassination. Fortunately for me, his men had become accustomed to certain benefits of working with Asari. Mm -hmm. Sounds like you changed the rules and the battlefield. Krogan nature made it easy for us to take advantage. Patriarch's men abandoned him in droves. In the end, we fought face to face on this very spot. The toughest fight of my life. But of course I won. So you kept him around as a trophy? I did. A trophy and an example. Whenever someone thought about taking me on, I pointed them to Patriarch. I suppose I still can. See, I like bowling trophies. You don't need to feed, water, worry about people trying to assassinate them. And a Krogan might get annoyed if you try to put the little plaque on them. All Interesting. Right. Well, let's move on. Do you need something else? Thanks. Maybe I'll come back later. You should find a nice young man to keep you warm in the meantime. You look like you need to loosen up a little. Um, thanks for the advice, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>